Welcome to I Propose a Toast, the only online cooking school that teaches you how to cook entire meals using nothing but a toaster. multi-function stainless steel series toaster and we're going to be cooking this entire breakfast using it. So we're going to be doing hash browns, Canadian back bacon, some free range eggs, some nice sourdough toast with a little green onion garnish to top it off. All right, to start off the meal, we're going to get the hash browns because they take the longest out of every other ingredient here. You want to take your toaster and you're going to want to max out that time. You're going to pop these suckers for as long as possible here. Pop them both in here. All right, so once you get your hash browns down and cooking, you're gonna to wanna to get your skillet heated up here, cast iron. I'm gonna place it right on top here, try and cover as much holes, get as much heat distribution as possible. Not bad, eh? All right, the hash browns have popped for the first time here. We're gonna take a look at them, see how they're doing. Real careful, this puppy heats up pretty hot. They're, uh, they're getting there, but I think it's gonna take another pop here. Not quite toasted though, and that's really what you want, that golden brown. So we're gonna pop that down again, take the skillet, right back on top there. So now as we're waiting for the second pop here for the hash browns, we're gonna get our green onions started here. We're gonna dice it up quite finely as a nice garnish. We're gonna do it as finely as possible. Beautiful green onions. <laughs> All right, so we're just gonna pop this onto the side here and uh, get the next step going. We're gonna melt the butter in the skillet to get ready for the eggs. You wanna use very fine quality butter here. So you're just gonna stick your little knife in there, get a nice dollop going. There you go, you wanna try and coat the whole bottom there. Oh yeah. yeah we're just gonna take a look at the, how these hash browns are coming along here. Very nice golden brown. So, we're gonna very carefully always unplug the toaster before retrieving anything out of it. So we're just gonna take these puppies out of here. One there, two beautiful golden brown hash browns. So we're just gonna pop the skillet back on there to retain the heat while we get prepared for the next step. We're gonna get the hash browns out of the way here and get the eggs rolling. We got the free range island gold. So we're gonna do one at a time here. Nice and easy. Boom. So the egg has gotten quite evenly cooked throughout here, but the top still needs a little more. So we're just gonna give it a little flip here just to finish her off, take her home. Very carefully get in there. Next, we're gonna get the, get the Canadian back bacon rolling here. Slide one slice into each and give a little pop there. Perfect. Is that all the way down? They just stuck to the, they just stuck to the sides. Then we're gonna take our egg, pop it back on there. Eggs done now. Eggs done now. So now we have our ham cooking here, so we're done with this for now. Eggs looking great. We're just gonna go ahead and plate that here where we have an extra second. Carefully plate the egg so as not to break the yolk. Now that's a good looking egg. All right, so we got the hams cooking in there. I got another egg cooking. We're rolling. <laughs> All right, so as you just heard, the ham just popped here. So we're gonna take a look at that, see how she's looking here. Oh, look at that. Seared on the outside, the perfect Canadian back bacon. So the egg is coming along here. We're gonna pop it back on here while we get our raw toast going. So next we're gonna get the toast going here. So we're gonna just get the egg out of the way first because we're gonna have to flip it also. And we're gonna grab our raw toast right over here. Nice sourdough. So you take your raw toast and put it in the toaster here. And you're gonna wanna be careful with this because this toaster's been running over time. It's very hot. It's gonna cook very fast. So while we got that in there, we're gonna flip the remaining egg. Is that a beautiful little flip? Perfect flip. So we're just gonna wait about 30 seconds here for this egg to finish up. And by then the toast 
should be done. All right, you're gonna wanna make sure that you check on your toes periodically just to make sure she's not getting uh, overcooked here. She's got a little ways to go. What you want is to get a nice golden brown on there. So you grab your second egg off of here, she's ready to go. And we're just gonna plate that while the toast finishes up. Be careful with the egg, will pop the yolk there. Perfect. <laughs> Beautiful toast. Look at that. Not a second too soon. All righty. So now you're gonna wanna butter your bread. Stop it, you're not gonna be able to. Just don't even bother. No? No. <laughs> and now, for your complete breakfast. This has been Miguel for I Propose a Toast. Next time, lunch.